Welcome, Dale, the engineer. Hi. <laughs> Hello, Dale. Right, Dale, you haven't had the machine long. No. This is a big whopper of a machine. <laughs> Surely you should be like a kid or a big kid in a sweet shop here. I am a bit. This, <laughs> I've used smaller machines in the past and struggled doing large parts, having to move them around the machine bed, making four ops instead of one op. Mm. Because this machine is capable of doing it all in one, so so much better. Is it enjoyable is it for an engineer to have such a colossal size of a machine in your workshop? I find it enjoyable personally, yes. But then I've always done a lot of big work, which as I say I've struggled with. Now I don't have to struggle. Well, I, it's just, I just do it all in one go. So what the setup here with the Y and the X axis, how does that work and benefit you? Well, the, the Y axis is very large, one, one meter of movement, which is very rare in a, in a machine. So it gives you that, that width to do big parts in one go, as I say. And accessibility, is this good? It's, it's perfect, yeah, the doors open really wide. So you get anything in through the front, via the steps, obviously, but yeah. And it's a 20 turn machine. 20 tons. Wow. Okay. How did you even get it in here? <laughs> With great difficulty. <laughs> Good question. I wasn't actually here. But. <laughs> <laughs> With great difficulty. But yeah. it's a big machine. But how does that long term help you at Meddings with the finished parts, basically? Yeah, it, just, it just gives you that extra rigidity when you're using long tools, big tools. Stops the vibration on the part. Mm -hmm. Hence, you get a better finish. Now you've got 30 tools in there, BT40. 30 tools, carousel, yes. Uh, BT40 good BT4, for you? BT40, yeah. There is an option for a BT50, but don't really think it's necessary. And the, the tools are a lot more expensive for a BT50, so... Right, and you've gone for this one. But you have chosen as an optional extra to go for the fourth axis on this case. We have, yes. So, so how does that help you? This is really helpful. you doing round parts, any sort of slots, holes in the side of a round part just on the fourth axis, go with any angle we want, just do the part all in one go. And that's going to help you because? It saves multiple setups doing, doing different yeah. angles. Now I know one of your favourite parts to the machine is the control panel and the software. Why is that? I just basically like the ease of use. Other machines tend to use G-codes, which is much harder to write a programme on the machine. Whereas this shop mill, you just find the cycle you want, open up the page, write in what you want to do, and the machine does it for you. So that easy? It's that easy, yeah. And that's going to make your life easier, isn't it, really? Oh, without a doubt, yes. It means you don't have to go to the CAD cam every time you want to do a programme. You can actually do it quite complicated programmes on the machine. Just to finish then, anything else on the machine that you like? The machine has tool setting on, on it, which you can set tool diameters and tool lengths, which means you don't have to get in the machine at all to do any tool setting. It's all automated on the control panel. So also has a 10,000 spindle, which is ideal for doing fast work on aluminium. And right down through the range, you're doing mild steel, stainless steel. It's so versatile. Dale, is it safe to say you're a happy engineer right now? I'm a very happy engineer <laughs> right now, yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. Because it's finished. <laughs>